hallelujah, glory to God. Much larger than you can even understand. And God said, even your prayers.
because you are operating and moving with a made up mind, God said breakthrough is here now. Glory to God. Somebody get here
Glory, glory, glory. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Glory, hallelujah. You can receive that glory to God. Jesus. Hallelujah. Then we bless God. I bless God for you. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And I decree and I declare. Hallelujah. This is Joe. In the matter of these next six months, hallelujah, you're going to meet your destiny. Mm. You're going to come to understand what am I here for? Thank you, Lord. Why am I still in the earth? Because the truth is, you're not supposed to be walking around in the earth. She and says, if the enemy hey, God, you with everybody, Glory. you would have been dead and gone. But because God has his hand on your life. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And everything, glory to God, that you feel like you've been stuck in. God said between now and December 31st of this year, if you purpose in your mind to say, God, I want to come out. Mm -hmm. God said, I'm going to walk you out. Glory, glory. Just like he did Peter. Jesus. He woke Peter up and he walked him. Even through the guards. Even yeah. through the prison. Even through the doors. Even through the bondage. Even through the hardship. Even through everything Peter was going through. Yes, he walked God. him out. Yes, he did. And when Hallelujah. he got to the iron gate, the Bible decrees that the iron gate opened. <laughs> glory, glory, glory. Hey. The iron gate represents the hard place. Jesus. If you keep walking with God right now, in this moment and in this season, Jesus. the hard place, God said, I'm going to make it open up Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. And people can come down Hallelujah, you Jesus. Jesus. And you understand, see, that people assuming that they know what your hard place is, but they don't know what's going on inside of here. Thank you, Lord. They don't know what's going on inside of there. And I decree you're going to live to see it. To the end of the year, glory to God. And by the end of this year, you're going to say, Man, my life is wholly transformed. Jesus. My life is changed. Hallelujah. See, some people and some things going to look the same, but not my you. My God. Hallelujah. Not you. Jesus. Glory. Don't say it because I just said it. Glory, glory. But I really need you to receive this by faith. While everybody, hallelujah. See, we dance and we shout. you like, Oh, child. Ain't got no dance yet. Thank you, Lord. Ain't got no praise worked out yet. Mm. But God just needs some real believers. Mm. Ain't got to dress it up. You ain't got to put nothing on it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Stay right here. You ain't got to put nothing on it. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All you have to do is believe. All you have to do is believe. Believe in your heart. <laughs> And begin to confess with your mouth that Jesus is the Lord. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, Glory to God. Ain't no other Lord coming. Ain't nobody else going to give it to you like he can. And ain't nobody else can do it for you like he can. What the believers at? I thought y'all were believers. They make it. I can tell how they act. They act like church folks. Hallelujah. But right now, hallelujah. Anything you in, God's going to deliver you out of. I can create an idea. I'm telling you decisions are overturned for you. I'm telling you that favor is resting in your life. Some folks can't get what you're about to get. My they God. don't even understand to ask for it. But I stand in the place, hallelujah, in the house of God as a woman of God, hallelujah. What about you? Like, in the apostolic power and authority in Jesus Christ to say you have the hand of God on your life and it's going to deliver you. Even those things you think you can't let go of, God said, I'm going to remove Thank you, Lord. I'm going to let him go. I'm going, you ain't going to want it. You're not even going to desire it. And even now as I speak, it's happening. Because all those things are running through your mind. And all Jesus, those things Jesus, are running Jesus. in your thoughts. Hallelujah. And you like me. Hallelujah. I'm hard no punk Kool-Aid. Don't punk. We ain't got no free. We don't. Okay. She laughed and she laughed. Oh, no. I ain't, we ain't scared like that. We made like that. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But some folk, hallelujah, don't understand that when you have been gripped and when you have been wrestling and entangled with true enemies, glory to God, with the enemy of your soul, hallelujah, you look around and you can't even figure out how you got there. Because that's not who you are. Mm, mm, mm. But the Lord said, my hand is upon you. Mm -hmm. And by the 
end of this year, these next six months, hallelujah. Lord. Well, really, six and a half, because we're going to start today. Mm, mm. It starts Hallelujah. Today. God is already pricking your heart. He's already working on your behalf. He's already giving favor in places, and you're going to have to ask for the favor. Don't be afraid to ask for it in this season. Don't be afraid to ask for grace. Don't be afraid to ask for mercy. Hallelujah. It's in your mouth. Hallelujah. And as you open your mouth, God said, I open mine. And I will command, hallelujah, on your behalf. Wow. And I will move on your behalf. Hallelujah. And I will open doors on your behalf. And I will cause you to experience a liberty you never had. Hallelujah. Never. Wow. Never. Hallelujah. Never had. Never had. Even among those who say they love you. Mm. Even among those who say they love you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When they see you the next time, mm. they're not going to recognize. Mm, 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 mm. People always try to put us in a place. But God said, I'm calling you out of dark places. Mm. Your joy is going to be restored. This season, your joy is going to be restored. You say, what well, I got to be happy about? Everything. Hallelujah. Yes. Everything. Hallelujah. Everything. Hallelujah. Everything. 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 Let me run it up for your life. Yeah. Huh? Y'all ain't even happy. Yeah. Huh? Breathing. Yeah. That you breathing, you got both lungs. Uh-huh. Yeah. You got both. You got two. Amen. Everybody took one right. Hallelujah. Your blood is running the right way. In yes. Your your heart is beating on time or else we would recognize Hallelujah. Yes. You can see me, right? So you got vision. Mm. Yes. You can hear me, right? So you got your hearing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How much further are we going to run? Can you smell? You can smell too? Lord, <laughs> can you smile? <laughs> <laughs> you got something. I saw you a little bit. I saw it a little bit. Hallelujah. I saw it a little bit. Hallelujah. Of course, everybody Come on here. Begin to thank him for the mm, small things. Mm, mm, mm. He said, I, gotta, I don't know about that smile and stuff. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Lord, thank you, Lord. God. But if you can crack the corners of your mouth. Mm, mm, mm. Yes, God. Joy is going to be restored unto you. Mm. You want Bless him, everything Lord. Bless him, Lord. to be content with, everything to be happy about, Bless everything. Because it was supposed yeah. to be another way. Yes, God. But since it was not. Glory, glory, glory. glory. God said there were bullets literally meant for you and they missed. They missed you. You didn't give it no thought. Hallelujah. God said they were meant for you. They were trying to kill you. But I'm so glad. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. I ain't telling you something I heard. I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. I remember crawling on the ground trying to get out the club. Jesus. And bullets flying over my head. Yeah. And about to leave everybody when I got to the car. Because if you didn't get there, I'm going anyway. Praise the Lord. I know what I'm talking about.
it's going to depend on how we listen when he says, come out. Yes. This your season. Mm, 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 this your time. Mm. Hallelujah. And he's going to bring you out better than when you went in. Amen. He's going to bring you out better. Better with favor. You like favor? Can you receive favor? Can you even receive that God's hand is on you? I don't oh, care hallelujah. what the enemy has said. Hey, hey. It's my season to live, y'all. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. It's your season, yeah. hallelujah, to come out, hallelujah. But you've got to understand, hallelujah, that it don't matter how low or how far down we are, God has the ability to raise us up. You believe yeah. that? Yeah. Just lift your hands and say, God, I receive it. And we're going to rejoice. Hallelujah. We're going to rejoice. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because we receive it. Hallelujah. Glory to God. When you feel like you poured out, hallelujah, glory to God. And you've not received back, God said it's your time to receive. It's your time to be strengthened. There are going to be those who are joined themselves. Hallelujah. Who encourage you. Hallelujah. You've encouraged everybody else. And God said, now I'm going to encourage you. I'm going to pull you in the secret chambers and begin to tell you all the and the open visions that you're having, yeah. it don't make you strange. Uh, Y'all right. stop listening to the enemy. Uh, it don't make you strange. Uh, God said, I'm trying to show you what's coming. I'm trying to show yeah, you what's happening. Yeah. I'm trying to show you. Because he always needs somebody he can reveal a thing to. Yeah. Yeah. He needs somebody he can reveal a thing to. And God said, because you won't take your life. You will receive it. Glory to God. And if you receive it, I can do something through you. See, when he show you something, it's for you to have, you have a responsibility. You have a responsibility. You have a responsibility. And you can't push it off for a possible. <laughs> receive it. I know you have. Hallelujah. He'll give you direction in it. Because when he reveals it to you, you're going to do something about it. You are the influencer that has ability to change and impact what's happening. Glory to God. If you can receive that, you can say, I'm going to handle it. Y'all ain't saying nothing. Olivia Pope said it better. Hallelujah. You can say, it's handled. God, if you put it in my hand, it's handled. God, if you put it on my shoulders, it's handled. God, if you put it in my heart, it's handled. God, if you put it in my shoulders, if you put it in my mind, it's handled. Hallelujah. I know you're an unknown praise mom ministry, but we're going to call you the handler from now on.
of who they touch and put their mouth on and who they treat wrong. You better be young, but that don't mean treat you bad. That don't mean mistreat you. That don't mean overlook you or discount you. You're not a discounted part of God's mercy now. It's a full release on you. Hallelujah. And anybody who can bless you, anybody who will bless God for you, hallelujah. They, see, you can't even figure out. Everybody that help you, they get blessed. God said, because you're blessed, I'm going to bless them that bless you. And the same ones that curse you. I wish I had a word for you here. But the one decree that I'm going to curse them that curse you. They should have never put their mouth on you. They shouldn't have put their hand on you. They shouldn't have overlooked you. Glory to God. But God said, that's okay. I hid you in the midst. Because they was going to do wrong by you. Glory to God. And it was when you said, okay, well, everybody do what they say. And you didn't say it like I just said. It. You got a little baby or something going, right? Hallelujah. Glory to God. But it was, hey, take your eyes off of other folks. Because they're not going to, they're not, they're not going to um, acclaim to the status. That God is going to raise you and going to lift you. Hallelujah. And he is not, hallelujah, he is not taking any mess over you. In 30 days from here, God said, watch what I do to them. Watch what I do to them. Watch what I do to them. You got them in your mind right now. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Watch what I do to them. It's not Hallelujah. It's because of what they did to you. It's not because they just want to do it. But when you see y'all gotta be able to handle God's God's property right. 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 See, okay, well maybe I just understand this. Hallelujah. But I start praying and make mercy and grace on folks who let the devil use them in my life. Because they don't understand God will kill you over me. See how low it gets? They get nervous. They're like, ooh, she getting spooky. I'm not getting spooky. You go ask Cora and his family. Ask Cora. They're down there talking against Moses, but he don't know all that. God let the ground open up on him. Yeah. 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 But they didn't realize Moses was God's man. Yeah. That's God's man. Amen. Y'all better stop messing with me. Who messes? You want me to? Okay. He don't want me to give him, but I will. Let's see. Let's call him This ain't for fashion. This. Come on, man. Fashion, yeah. Come on. You got some enforcers. Ta da, ta da, ta Glory to God. And I just really, I shook your hand and I began to pray. Because all the Lord told me to do was speak a blessing over you. Glory to God. Because enough people have been cursing you and speaking against you and saying what you won't do. Hallelujah. You're going to do everything God has put in you to do. You're going to walk in the way that God, how about shot, even with the mantle that's on your life, that you're trying to figure this thing out. And you're trying to understand it. And why do I have to be like this? Because you're God's man. Other folks can dress it up. Papa said it earlier, they can put the collar on and all that stuff. You're God's man. And they won't be able to handle when you come through, when you come into the realization of who you are in God. You just watch. They mess with you, you ain't gonna be long. You ain't gotta even say nothing. And so give them the pass, and all you're doing is passing them on to God. You say, God bless you. God have your way. God be with them. He gonna get with them. He's going to get right with me. Throw your hands up and say, I'm God's man. Y'all hear that? Y'all didn't even hear that. You're trying to get to me. I don't know what you need to do. See, y'all don't. Say, go ahead. Say, I'm God's man. man. Y'all hear that? And when they mess over you and they do you wrong, hallelujah. Say, I'm God's man. God going to take care of that. Right. And he's going to take care of you. Amen. I promise he will. I promise you will. Yeah. Apostle, y'all go and tell me. Hey, hey, go and tell me. See how folks, they forgot we were still in church because the music stopped. <laughs> That's God's man. Hallelujah. Yeah. 
Glory to God. Handle me carefully. <laughs> Somebody shout glory. Glory, glory. Glory, Shout glory. I just want to share this quick. It's going to be quick. Y'all ain't heard nothing. I promise y'all. You better praise me. Jump up and praise with you or something. Because I done praise. I done shout. I done sing. Hallelujah. All to the glory of God. Bless the name of God. Uh, I'm sharing out of two texts. Luke 5, 17 says this. And it came to pass on a certain day as he was teaching, talking about Jesus, that there were Pharisees and doctors of the law sitting by, which were come out of every town of Galilee and Judea and Jerusalem. And the power of the Lord was present to heal them. Somebody shout the power in the house. The power in the house. Hallelujah. Glory to God. The power in the house. Glory to God. If I could go a little further and just go back in the next, in the previous book, glory to God, in St. Mark chapter 2, glory to God, it says, uh, verse uh, chapter 2, it says that there were four men, glory to God, hallelujah, as Jesus was in Capernaum teaching, glory to God, it was four men there, glory to God, and that they heard that Jesus was in the house. And so Luke records it and describes it that there was power in the house. And these men heard that Jesus was in the house. Glory to God. Now, Apostle McNeil, I just want, I just came to encourage you and encourage this tabernacle of praise. Glory to God. I came to encourage you to let you know that when Jesus is in the house, the power is in the house. Because Jesus is the power that we must have in the house. Glory to God. Now, that is not what I was going to preach, but God said, say this, hallelujah, and say it in this manner, Sam, glory to God. And so he began to say that there were four friends that when they heard that Jesus was in the house, glory to God, that they carried their other friend, hallelujah, there's a fifth man who was paralyzed and said he had the palsy, glory to God. And so I'm going to preach fast and sit down. Is that all right? Okay, well, hallelujah, if it ain't, I am. Praise the Lord. And so then I'm paraphrasing in this text here, and so it is that that Jesus was in the house and he was teaching and preaching glory to God. Don't sit on me. I pray with y'all. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And he was preaching and teaching glory to God. And while he was there, they brought people to him so that they could get healed. I don't know what you come to do, but when you come into the house of God, you And the teachers 
children they are family hot and the teachers were there and so the teachers who didn't even believe in Jesus you gonna have folk in the house that don't even believe in hallelujah you gonna have folk in the house who don't even really want to listen they just want to see what you gonna say and even when you say what you gonna say they still can't see it y'all ain't say nothing you gonna have
by your faith. They're going to get delivered by your faith. How many believers we have in here?
Because guess what? The four friends didn't jump down in the house. They lowered their friends. They lowered the fifth man who was paralyzed. And the Bible decrees, y'all can go back and read this. You can check me if you want, Apostle. Whichever one. Yeah. Uh, the Bible decrees that when Jesus saw their faith, I 
talking about ninjas. Sometimes you can't see them coming. Get the folk who you don't expect. Tell them, come down to my church. The power's in the house. 